Aye, Jim. Here's another tip for you. Right. What you're going to be doing is creating more backlinks using what they call pinging sites. And what I suggest you do, you come to your website, jwgretail.co.uk and just go into each category. So, I'm just picking the electronics. For the moment, and what you want to do is click on, say, about half a dozen of your, of your products that you think would sell well. So let's see, let's go to JVC Portable CD Boom Blaster with Integrated iPod. Right, this gives you the the page URL up here on the, the browser bar. And what you want to do is open up a notepad file. So we're just going to name this Electronics. What you want to do is copy these URLs that you've got. So just go up to the browser bar, select them, and right click, copy, and paste them in. And then go to the next one. So just go back to electronics. And just go into this one. Copy the URL again, so just click on it, copy, paste that into your notepad as well. I'm just going to click the back button to go back to that page. I'm just going to pick up this one. So just click on the link, right click on it, click copy, put that in your notepad as well. Paste. Right, so that's three links. What you want to do is go through and do half a dozen links. Then what you want to do has come to a site called HTML to RSS. That's the URL up there. So you just go to HTML to the number RSS.com. Obviously, I already have an account with this company. But all you need to do is sign up for a new account. <coughs> it's free, doesn't cost you anything. So just pick a username, a password, uh, supply them an email address, your site URL, which would obviously be JWG, site title, whatever it is, upload a, a picture, uh, either a picture of yourself or a logo for your site, small bio, create an account, and boom, you're done. And I'm actually just going to log in just to show you how this works. when it gets round to it. So just gonna log in with my details and my password. <coughs> so what you want to do is you want to click on URLs to feed. Now obviously the, the three URLs that I picked up were all electronics, so I'm just going to call this feed electronics or electrical goods or, or whatever you want to call it. And then all you need to do is go back to your notepad, take the feeds, the sorry, the 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 products you've you've taken, the, the URLs, you just need to copy them, paste them into here and then create RSS feed. And what that'll do is it creates this RSS feed. So you just want to click on that, right click on it, copy it. Then you take that RSS feed 
and you go to a site called pingler.com which is this URL pingler.com <coughs> now you don't need to sign up for this I mean I have an account but I don't I never ever use it to be fair I just use the free one so all you need to do is what you want to do is submit a feed uh, if I can remember how to do this uh, click on home it's because I've already logged in I was pinging something already Jim so all you want to do is put in your keyword so let's say we call it electrical go away keyword is electrical goods you put in that feed URL so I'm just pasting that in I'm going to pick a category which will be computer and electronics you put in this we capture code so 6xd1z now you just click ping and what that will do is it will ping that URL and it pings it out to 82 different services which will give you back links back to your website you'll notice that it says on the screen there as you're placing the queue is number 19 see when you get to 1 obviously that will start pinging all your sites Another place you can come is a place called bulkping.com B-U-L-K-P-I-N-G dot com And again all you need to do is paste that URL into here the one that you got from H2 HTML to RSS Put in your keyword anchor text, so again we'll just call it, in fact I'll not call it that at all, I'll call it uh, cool gadgets for men. Put in your recapture code which is 45718, whoops, 45718, click submit. And what that does again is what it's going to do is it's going to ping those feeds right across the, the web and get you back links back to your website which will increase your traffic. Now not all of these always go through, it's just one of these things. But it's what it's done is it's pinged those that link to twenty four different search engines. And that should certainly help increase your traffic to your website just while I'm on haven't you been in an analytics for a while see how you're actually doing and your website traffic is still growing you're up 123 percent uh, 215 visitors last month which is pretty good and they're staying on the website for quite a while as well about 12 minutes on average and you get quite a low bounce rate so you're doing okay but obviously putting in these backlinks will help considerably now a quick tip for you so I'm just going to show you a wee trick how to use Google Analytics to its best effect. Right, see your traffic report down here. See the ones that are coming from the search engines. What you want to do is view that report. And you want to look at the keywords that people are searching on down here. Uh, for some reason the keywords are not set I don't know where that traffic's coming from whether you're doing pay-per-click or whatever you're doing it's probably pay-per-click 
but see the ones you want to concentrate on. I see like this one here. Now you might not see actually because the screen's just below, but you've got 26cc Yama buggy people are searching for, and petrol RC monster trucks Hummer people are searching for, and Spurl RC NQD, which is another key phrase that people are searching for. So what we want to do is use them as the the um, the anchor text for these pinging services. So like your your pingler, you would use that as your anchor text. Uh, your free mass pinger, you would use that as your anchor text to boost obviously your rankings for those search terms. And that's basically it. Um, that, as I say, what you want to do is go through all of your categories, home and garden, office and stationery, PC games and console, personal care, toys and games, gadgets, and grab the URLs, feed them into HTML to RSS, and make separate feeds for each of your categories. Pick up the RSS feeds, keep them in a notepad like this. So you would have, like L electronics, you'll now have, um, put that in as RSS feed for that one. And you would pick up this RSS feed, copy it, and just paste that in. Then every two or three days, all you need to do is pick up this URL. Go to pingler.com, go to free ma uh, mass bulk ping.com and just ping it. And that'll give you hundreds of backlinks that will bring traffic to your website. Alright, I hope you enjoyed that. Uh, if you've got any uh, questions, obviously just get back to me. Alright, cheers, Jim. Bye.